Ah, uh, what a nice day of not thinking about him. Oh! Oh, hey! Oh, it's you! Wow! Oh my god, this is so awkward! I didn't realize you were here! Wow, I was just walking out of this building bragging about how I'm completely over you and I never think about you anymore, and how I'm so much happier in life now that you're not a part of it, and how I'm just so glad that we went our separate ways, and that everything is better now that you're no longer there! Huh? Oh, oh, what's that? You feeling a little jealous? Huh? Yeah? You a little upset? You maybe, you maybe want to regret what you did? You want to maybe talk to me now? Huh? Huh? Want to tell me to take you back? Huh? Huh? You want? You just want my attention, huh? Yo, oh, what do I have to do? Ugh. Yeah, yeah, move. You, you were mean. You're, you're, you're near me out. Okay. No. Oh my God! Why does anyone talk to me? Uh. What's going on guys, Young with Hardy Tech, and welcome back to Pokemon White Platinum, the Nuzlocke run. In the last episode, we left off in the middle of a forest, because I... Okay, the way I do my videos, and I'm just gonna walk around this pole because I can, but the way I do my videos is that, um, I pretty much, I just record and I play until I start to get bored, and when I get bored, I just stop, because if I'm bored, then there's like, what's the point of making... What, what are you doing? Uh, you can tell just by looking at trainers today, have the capacity to transfer... Wait, what, what, what? Oh, oh, it's a Larvesta! Yes, yes, give it, give it, no, no, give it, give, give, give me the Larvesta! Oh my god, no, I already got a meta, but no, I want it, I want it, I want it! No! I wonder why he doesn't show us the Larvesta. Huh, that's weird. Hey, okay, that's like the third time I tried picking up that burn heal now. Anyways, like I was saying, uh, the way I do my videos is I pretty much just record until I get bored, and because when I start to get bored, I know that the commentary isn't going to be very good. And it's just, it's not going to be exciting for anybody. So it's just, it's just best to cut it off there. And to keep the sanity from going into, like, craziness and I don't even know words. Um, yeah, that's why we just stopped in the middle of a forest. But a lot of the times, like, when that happens, when I get, like, I start to get bored, it's because I don't, like, what is this? I want to, I want to pick up all this stuff. Yeah, I got to go to a Pokemon and sell some stuff. Um, basically, like, uh, usually I won't have things to talk about. Like, I'll... I just like sitting here like randomly just boring out words because I don't have any kind of topic in mind and when I don't have any topic in mind or a lot of times like my little rambling seem to work out well but even if I can't think of anything to like ramble about then it oh so I can't pick up the super potion because freaking bag logic you know right why can't I just group the burn heals and the charcoals together you get burned by the charcoal and then the burn heal heals your burn huh that's bag logic right there. It should work, but it doesn't. So, basically, yeah, today, in case I start to get bored, I have something I want to talk about, so we'll get to that later. But, oh! Oh, who are you? Oh, great, it's Pearl again. Finally, we meet again! I've been training a lot, and I'm ready to test myself against you once more! Um, so, I was actually thinking about this last night, and it was kind of ironic because I woke up today and read a comment on the last video of that said the exact same thing, and I was thinking about copies move sets and about my team and I realize I got to start focusing pretty much I don't think this game is gonna be that challenging until we get to the world championship because apparently there's a lot of like level 100 Pokemon there like at least I think Ash has a team of level 100 Pokemon so we got to kind of get our head in the game and I got to start preparing my team for that and no I'm obviously not gonna go into the world championship with level 100 Pokemon because dude, that's no fun but um Looking at my team now, I kind of... Wow, okay, so we're gonna... Why am I battling with coffee? Why am I not switching out? Because I can just Shadow Ball again and kill the Venusaur, that's why. Um, so I gotta start focusing on what do I want my team to be by the time we get to that. And looking at my team, I don't really think Unpheasant is gonna be... Let's just take a look at the team really quick. I don't think Unpheasant is gonna be very useful. I like everybody on my team, except Unpheasant. And looking at Coffee's moveset... Um, offensively, he has Crunch and Shadow Ball, which are both super effective against the same types, being Ghost and Psychic. So, they are completely useless to have both of these, especially since Shadow Ball is Stab and Crunch isn't. So, I decided I'm going to get rid of Crunch and give him Fly. And then we will be able to take off um, Quinn, because I don't actually think we need Glide for any other part of the game, except for like that one part where we used it. So, but if we do need Glide, we can simply just come back and get Coffee again. And now I'm getting Skyped, so ignore that. 
or not Kabu, we could get Quinn, and, but yeah, so when we get to Pokemart, we're going to be replacing Quinn with a new permanent team member, which I have an idea on who it's going to be, and um, I will save that as a surprise for you guys. Wait, is this a new route? I'm not, I wasn't paying attention. Uh, Flannery Woods, Route 506. I think this is a new route, so... Um, oh, Growlithe, interesting. Um, let's try Dragon Clawing. If it lives, it's not going to live. I just realized how high level we are. Oh well. Well, it doesn't matter. People are like begging for me to use Charmeleon, so... Uh, Flaminary City. That is an interesting town name, sir. I like this very much. Before we get anything else, let's go to Pokemon Center before I forget. So, Quinn, you're going to be entering the box, and let's go get that special Pokemon I'm talking about. If we still have... Okay, I was going to say... I hope I went back and got him, because I still, as you can probably tell, I haven't re-caught a lot of the Pokemon that I lost from my save file when I had to replay it. But luckily, we probably won't need some of those Pokemon. So the Pokemon we're going to be taking is... Bidoof! No, not really. We're going to be taking Larvitar! Yay! Because we could use a Rock-type, and he's also Dark-type, so that's really good cover. Oh, actually, now that I'm thinking about it... We already have a dark... Well, uh, we don't have a dark-type Pokemon. So, do we need a dark-type Pokemon? Do we need a rock-type Pokemon? Oh my god, now, see, now I'm questioning everything. I should have just gone with it. But no, now I'm like super freaking paranoid about do I need a dark-type and a rock-type? But it's like, well, I already have a fighting-type. I don't really need a steel-type, so he's not going to be very useful. Do I I already have a fire-type, a water-type. I don't need a normal-type. I don't need a corefish. I don't need a go-back because he doesn't even fly. I don't need a corefish because I already got boys again. I don't need a water. I just walk. I just, I don't know. It's either Dratini. I already have a drag-type. I don't need Dratini. It's either Gato or freaking Dino. Gato or Dino or, or Faceless, but... Well, yeah, uh, I just, I don't know, okay, it's a lot of, it's a tough choice, he's not even a dark type until, like, level 55, oh my god, I didn't think this through, oh, what do I do? Okay, okay, we're gonna leave this up to a random number generator, and, um, no, that's a lot of, that's a lot of hard work, I got a coin, okay, so, Dino's gonna be one of the options, right, this, the first coin I'm gonna flip, we're gonna do heads for, what, what kind of coin is this? Okay, for some reason I have like a Canadian penny, um, whatever. Um, anyways, if it's heads, then Gato will be an option. If it's tails, faceless will be an option, okay? You guys are just gonna have to trust me on this because I'm not gonna be showing you my coin. And it's heads. Okay, so it's either Gato or it's Dino. And the option, and it is, it's, okay, I, I dropped the coin, uh, my bad. <laughs> it's heads, son of a bitch. We gotta take Gato. Fuck! No, I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to take him, man. All right, we have, whatever. I'm sticking by my word. We're gonna take Gato, and he's gonna be the best team. Watch. I'm hating on him now. By the end of this let's play, I'm gonna be loving him. Okay, let's go to Pokemon and sell some stuff, cause apparently, like in the last episode when I got rid of items, I had revives and I kept them instead of like throwing them away. Which I don't know why. Where's? Okay, there's the Pokemon. Man, they hit the Pokemon in this place. That is. Why would they do that? What did the Pokemon ever do to you? I can't believe I have to use Gato, man. I I remember my Purloin from my very first Nuzlocke ever, Blaze Black, all like a year and a half ago. And that thing, it that was the second Pokemon to die, and it died catching Totodile, who went on to be like one of my best Pokemon. So uh, I think it was worth sacrificing Gato to get Totodile. I was oh god, I don't know. Do I want to sell the Firestones? Yeah, I'm not gonna be using anything that evolves with a Firestone. Um, what else don't I need? A Moonstone? We can sell that. Um... Oh my god, if I sold the Leftovers, you guys would kill me. At least you guys have stopped yelling at me to use the Leftovers. I appreciate that. For a long time, people were just getting on my case so much because I wasn't using the Leftovers. And it bothered you guys so much, which I found hilarious. Um, I'm gonna wait till Gato evolves to teach him any potential TMs, because I don't know what he learns. But I I want to think... Uh, Aron? You maybe want to move? Aro, Aro, Aro. No, I, I asked move, not sit still. Uh, please. I want to. I want to go. If, you know, I don't even want to go in the gym. I don't like this gym, anyways. So I have a feeling whatever gift Pokemon we can get in this place is probably a fire type. So, is the gym leader in here? I don't. I don't know where to go. But I like the music in here. It's catchy. Gym leader. Nope. Okay. It's not. What is? What is going on with my emulator? It's acting all glitchy. Gym leader, come out, come out, wherever you are. Um, is it, are you over here? No? No? Okay. You know, oh, wait, what is, what is this even? I don't even know what this is. It's a hot spring. <gasps> I want to go in a hot spring. 
Aww, that seems like so much fun. I wonder if we get a why not at this hot spring too. Okay, well, where is this? Why is no one ever doing? Okay, well, as far as we know, the gym leader may actually be in there. And oh, yeah, other trainers are allowed to enter here. You douchebag. You know what? I don't even care. I'll go wherever I want. Where are we supposed to go? What the heck? Just let us do our job and beat people up. That is that is our job. Route 507. Okay, you know what? Oh, is this? Wait, what is TM20? That could be something really amazing. It's safeguard. Oh my god, I should sell that. Okay, this is the route we wanted to go and we couldn't go this way. So let's not jump down that way. Where's the gym leader? What? Why is this game? Whoa. Whoa. Oh my god, god. Oh my god. We're out of building. Uh huh. We're out of the roof. Yeah. Um, okay, well that was exciting for like two seconds. Um, I guess we'll just start rampaging like every house until we find somebody. Unless one of you are the gym leaders, and then you're like in disguise. So I don't appreciate that. Okay, you're working on Pokeballs, blah blah blah. These boxes are loaded with Pokeballs to be shipped all over the world. Oh, is this a Pokeball factory? Oh, that's kind of cool actually. I assume this is like some kind of like place where they burn things, because this is like a fire city. Like, oh, you burn things. That's cool. The danger of living in Flaminary, Flaminary, Flamer, Flamerny City is that Mount Vulcan can erupt at any minute and destroy the city. That's gotta be really nice to know. Just like, oh, I'm just chilling here. It's cool. Oh my god, my house is on fire. But it's okay. Because a new Hardy Tech Yo-Yo video was just uploaded. And that makes life a-okay. Uh, there's both fire and type bug Pokemon, but I don't know its name. It's... Oh my god, I could've had one of those. And I could've... I... 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 I, I can't go outside. Hello? Hello? Let me out. Ah, I hate this game so much. Okay, I bet it's this house. This house is wood in front of it. This is the house where we're... Okay, no, this isn't the house where we're supposed to go. I don't know... Why is this going to be so complicated? It doesn't make it clear... Oh, wait a minute. You look, in, you look different than everybody else. I bet you have something interesting to say. Oh, it's Professor Ellie. I, I didn't recognize you, sorry. Hey, Hardy, finally you made it to Flamerny City. I've been waiting for you here. As you can see, the city's infested with Aron. They come from Mount Volcan due to the overpopulation. The leader of this gym is in Mount Volcan studying them, but I don't know, you can just use a super pal to make them go away. I'm also a Pokemon trainer though, and I'd like to test myself again. Wait, what? What? No, why can't I just go like, sp like spray pepper spray in the Aron's eyes? Or I mean super repel, totally not pepper spray, because I'm not an evil person at all. Slowly puts the pepper spray back into my pocket. I would never do something like that. No, I didn't. Wow, did I really not heal up? I guess that's what happens when like you don't take any damage. It's like, what's the point in healing up? So, eh, you know, whatever. Gotta learn fake out. Okay, let's take a look at Gato's move set: sand attack, freeze slice, pursuit, and torment. Wow, you're just completely useless, aren't you? I don't want to use Gato. Don't make me do it. Uh, I don't know when we're gonna train up Copa because there's like not really a good chance having two underleveled Pokemon. We got it. I. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah, cool. That's nice. Just bring out the Pokemon and super effective against you. You're not a very smart Manectric, are you? You're also... Oh, Houndoom. Interesting. Um... Uh, let's use Cluckers. And we will... Oh, let's use Ice Smash for the first time. Oh, oh, and boom. You just got punched in the face by a chicken. How does it feel? You are a fire dog. And you just got punched in the face by a chicken. Doesn't feel too good, does it? I imagine. Wow, I just realized I'm out of Dragon Claws, so I can't Dragon Claw this thing. It's okay, I'll just Shadow Ball it because. Okay, well, that's kind of scary. Um. Don't use a Dragon. What it. Why are you glowing? What? What makes you glow? Are you just that radiant, Altaria? Are you just that beautiful? You just, like, sit around glowing all day? Like, bitch, I'm fabulous. <gasps> God is evolving! Actually, I don't know what level God evolved, but I think we actually caught Perloin at a level it could have evolved. So, oopsie. But we are now going to have a Perloin. No, Perloin's its default stage. What does it evolve into? It evolves... No, I don't want to look at... I'm not looking at the screen. I can do it. It evolves into... Um, Perloin evolves into... I... Wiper. Wiper. Oh, oh, cool, alright. Hey, I should know that. Um, you really are as great trainer as everyone says. Now take a super pal to the gym leader at Mount Vulcan so that these Aron will move in Lee Town. I'll return to my lab in Carmine Town. I'll carry a use fly. That was a Pidgeot, sir. Or at least it looked like a Pidgeot. Um, anyways, let's go heal up now because I need my Dragon Claws. Wonder what happens if you walk all the way there and then you don't have a super repel. 
Because that would suck. Do I have two propellers? I'm almost positive I saw some in my bag. Yes, okay, I have 28. Why can't I just spray these Aron with Super Repel? That seems like it'd be so much easier. But anyways, we are now in... This is an odd looking mountain. Can I just skip you? Oh, cool, I can. Wait, why are these trainers allowed in here? And I wasn't. That... That's that's messed up. Okay, I'm just gonna skip as many trainers as I can, because I just... I really don't want to be bothered by battling... Oh, wait, did he even battle me? Alright, whatever, let's catch Pokemon. It's a Torkoal. We already have one, so we get another chance. Yay! And... Um, wait. I am, like, very confused by this area. Alright, what is this Pokemon going to be? It's a Slugma. Interesting. Uh, not really. Well, Dragon Claw. I don't want the Slugma. I don't think we're going to be catching any more Pokemon like the rest of this Let's Play. So, for those of you who are, like, super excited to see what I get, I'm pretty much just going to kill everything. So, yeah. I hate to be that guy. Oh, another Firestone, because it's totally not like I just sold, like, three of those. Is it obvious I don't want Firestones? Wait, are you Team Steam? Is this Team Steam guy? Oh no, you're just a scientist. Okay, then why are you here like ruining everyone's day? You're not evil, you're just a Team Steam loser. You're confusing me very much, sir, and I'd like to ask you a few questions. If you could please step into my office where I will then proceed to kill you. Then I would. it would be greatly appreciated if we could work this out in a civilized manner where nobody will get hurt because we all agree that maybe it is for the best if you just do as I say and then I won't have to murder you. Very viciously. By shoving you in a hole by yourself for the rest of time. Do you want that? Do you want to live in a hole by yourself for the rest of time? I don't think you do. I think we can work this out if you're a good little uh, scientist. I'm not even battling the scientist anymore. What am I even talking about? Just, okay. Oh, oh, oh my god. No, 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 no. Koopa, Koopa, what? Ah. <laughs> What? What is that? What? Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, no! Koopa! What the heck? Uh, I was like so excited to. This, uh, man, I, I figured. Okay, Koopa can freaking handle a ride on. No, Koopa can't handle a ride on. Why did it have to hit four times? Oh, I'm such a sad Caterpie now. Man. That's seriously just a giant buzzkill. So, anyways, while we're going through all these trainers, earlier in the video I mentioned that I have a topic I want to talk about if I get the chance. And this seems like a good chance to talk about it until in about 30 seconds when I get interrupted because I'm not paying enough attention and I'll have to start screaming because I did something wrong and something will probably die just because I wanted to talk about a quick topic that literally wouldn't take too long, but I'm just making it overcomplicated now. So let's actually start talking about it before I go on forever. Okay, so... It seems a lot of times whenever I just have, like, time by myself, when I'm either driving or, like, whenever I'm trying to go to sleep, for some reasons, when I do the most thinking. And I'll start thinking of, like, commentary ideas of random things I could do videos about, whether it just be during grinding montages, just little skits in general, or things I could talk about. And a lot of the times, like, at the time, it seems like a... Okay, well, uh, never mind, we'll get to this later. Because um, now we found the stupid gym leader, and... Wow, you can really find fossil Pokemon in the wild? Okay, that's kind of stupid. Um... Uh, Oh, you're a guy? What? Really? Hello, we've already met Aziri at Manfer Marfer Ma Marfenny Lake. Can you give me a super repel to ward off these Aron? Luke used a super repel. Wow, thanks. That worked perfectly. I'll head back to the gym now. Okay, that's um cool. While we head back to the gym... What is what is down this way? This looks awfully suspicious. Um, There's got to be something down here. Oh, there is. It's an item. And it's also a, a Macargo. I, no, I want the item. What is it? Oh my god, this is going to be amazing. Oh my god, here we go. It's, it's TM38. Wow, that actually is so amazing. I love that TM so much. It's... Oh, okay. Actually, it's not horrible. It's Fire Blast. Okay. Um, as we're walking out of this cave, I'm going to use one of those fancy super repels so I don't keep wandering into wild encounters. And I'll actually try to talk about this really quick. So, a lot of the times... Um, I don't know if this happens to other YouTubers, but I'll like think of ideas and... Um, I think, wow, that's like such a good idea. And then I like want to record it right then, but I won't be able to record it because I'm like driving or I'm being lazy. And um, I'll think of like all these different topic ideas, but I'll never get the chance to use them because like later on when I actually have the chance and I'm thinking about it again, like when I didn't just think about it, I like it isn't fresh in my fresh in my mind. I kind of realize it's not that good of an idea, and that happens to me a lot like last night I was just kind of trying to fall asleep and bandit was staring at me and I just started thinking of like random video ideas and I have actually have one which I'll probably use 
in the next um, grinding montage for like another edition of Let's Discuss, which for the record, Let's Discuss is probably like my favorite series I do because it's it's just a part, I, I don't know why I like it so much, it's just a really fun series for me to do where we can just kind of all come together and discuss the topic and give our opinions on things. So for the record, assuming I actually stick with this idea and don't like chicken out, the next uh, grinding montage, which I assume will probably be before the Elite Four, because uh, I can't imagine we'll have to do grinding anytime soon, is probably going to be a Let's Discuss. For, so for those of you that actually like the Let's, the Let's Discuss videos where we can get together and like discuss random topics and stuff, you should enjoy the next video. And what is it about? Uh, I don't know. I don't want to say because I have a feeling I might change my mind on this topic. But, um... I don't know. I keep going real... I keep... Oh! I just realized the Koopa's dead. So we gotta go replace Koopa. That's freaking awesome. Okay, um... I don't know. Is there any other psychic types I didn't, like, recatch? Um... I don't... Oh my god. I just realized I have 12 dead Pokemon now. Actually, I technically have 13. I forgot Vibrabo isn't in a box. So, um, you know what? Let's look, let's look that up really quick. Let's save my game. And let's go look. This is my original save file, which got broken because of a glitch. So, let's look at the save box here. Do I have any Pokemon here I could use? Um, Swine Up. I don't need... Chewy is kind of an interesting... Well, we already have an Ice and a Grass type. So, I don't know. There's like... Uh, no one really fits the spot because I need like a psychic type or something and everyone here I already have coverage with so ah I don't know who to take I think we'll take um ah I think we'll take I don't know okay it's really hard I a Pete you know what I think well Crobat's a good option yeah, okay, we're gonna take a Golbat, and we're gonna get a Crobat, so... Deal with it, okay? That's just, that's what's gonna happen now. Now we have two super underleveled Pokemon, and that really don't benefit our team in any way. But I don't, I don't even care. I don't even care, man. I don't even care. <laughs> but I thought it was hilarious, actually. I think Golbat had the least amount of votes when we did the poll. Golbat only had one vote. So, I'm sure you guys are super excited to see him. That's because Turtwig and Giratina literally took... 50% of the votes, so, because they're just, they're like attention horse. but anyways, oh, he's got little Charizard statues in here, you know what, I like this guy, he has Charizard statues, that's A-OK -okay in my book, so, I'm surprised, why can't we not one-shot Magmars, we're a lot higher than them, we can't even like one-shot those wild ones, ooh, Magmortar, um, okay, that actually scares me, so I'm gonna use orange, um, I don't know what this guy's main Pokemon is, I wanna think his main Pokemon is a Magmortar? But, I don't know, seeing this guy use Magwater, it's making me think it's probably not that. Um, oh! Oh, no, I think it's, um... Um, what is its name? I think his main Pokemon is a Infernape. Maybe. I don't know. It, maybe it's a Charizard, because there is Charizard statues here, so that would make sense. Because, I mean, you don't go into a place and, like, make statues at that place unless you're going to, like, back up the idea that, like, Hey, we have this Pokemon, you shouldn't hate us, because we're awesome people, so... I'm going to support the idea that these are some awesome people, and I just thought of something. How does Giratina learn superpower when it has no hands? All it has is tentacles. Is it like whipping you with the tentacles? Because that's kind of weird. I'm not I'm not judging, you know? I think Giratina can do whatever it wants, but like serious time here, how does it use superpower? I don't know. It seems a little suspicious to me. Um, man, weird. Uh, weird. I don't know. I honestly don't know, like, what to do with my team. It's just... Ah, what did... Oh my god, stop that. Stop. Stop using... No, stop. <laughs> stop. <laughs> Fine, I'll just freaking Dragon Claw you. Jeez. Okay, that actually was a horrible idea, because both... I just realized... Giratina is weak to both of his stabs. I've never noticed that until, like, right now. Both Shadow Ball and Dragon Claw are super effective against Giratina. That's kind of interesting. Why do you learn Combine? Isn't Infernape a physical attacker? Actually, no. I think Infernape is actually um, mixed. I think Infernape can pull off both sets. But I didn't even know Gear T or Infernape learned Combine. I've never, like, ever seen a Giratina with Combine before. So, anyways, let's go take on this guy and his Charizard. Hi, Hardy. Welcome to the Flammerinary Ramminer City Gym. I'm the leader of this gym, and I'll battle you with the power of fire attacks to defend it. Man, that would have sounded so much better if he just said the power of fire. 
That would have been like really dramatic and he just like shoots fire out of his hand. And then he secretly turns into a firebender. And it would have just... Life would have been so much better if that actually happened. Admit it. Wouldn't you have liked to see that happen? He just magically turns into a firebender. Leads the fire nation to destroy the world. I would have loved to see that. Okay, I actually have a good feeling. Swords dance and slash and fake out. Oh my god, Gato is going to be a sweeper. You just wait and see. He's going to destroy everything. It's going to happen. You're just going to have to wait and watch, but it's going to happen. And you guys are going to be here to like see it. And it's just going to blow your mind. So, I should probably heal up. That's a little bit of scary. I'm kind of low on health there. So, um, let's heal up coffee. A lot of people are like yelling at me for using coffee. And I just, I don't understand. Really? Phone? Someone's tweeting. I don't even know, like, I don't get it. Who am I even following on Twitter that I get tweets from? But for some reason, I keep getting tweets from somebody. And I don't know who. And now it's starting to freak me out. Because I don't get tweets from Rusty. Or... I used to, you guys probably remember, I think in like Leaf Green, whenever Rusty would text something, I, or tweet something, I would get a text about it, and then I turned it off because she would start tweeting like every five minutes, so, I don't, I don't know who, I haven't like turned off for everybody, and I'm like randomly getting tweets from Texas from, tw nah, I'm getting Texas, guys, I'm having Texas on my phone, and it's amazing. Anyways, you surprised me with your battle prowess. Wow, I didn't even like acknowledge that battle the entire time I was talking. <laughs> you surprised me with your battle prowess. You were great, and as a reward, you earned a ruby badge. Where's my sapphire badge and my emerald badge? With the ruby badge, you can use fire blow outside of battle. Wow, that sounds like if you eat like some really hot Doritos and then you give a blow job, it'd be called a fire blow. Is that weird? Okay, either way, we got TM50, which is normally overheat, so I'm guessing. A fire blow is just like a reskin of overheat. So apparently it destroys. Why is fire blow the only move that could destroy logs? Why can't you just use ember? Or why can't you literally just like push the log? Why do you have to make it difficult and have what's the special move? Why is why can't rock smash break ice blocks? Yeah. Freaking poke logic, man. I don't understand it. Anyways, that's gonna wrap it up for today, guys. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like it. How about maybe I'm gonna I'm gonna set a really high goal because I don't think you guys are gonna be able to do this. You're gonna have to prove it to me. 18 likes. Yeah, I don't think you guys can do it. Prove me wrong. If you enjoyed the video, click that like button. Until next time, I'm Hardy Tig Yo Yo.